Hi, my name is Danielle Ramos. And hi, my name is Trisha Lopez. We're officers of the Puso Club at Mopitas High School, which is a Filipino cultural club that aims to bring our community together and bring awareness to our Filipino culture. And we do that by performing traditional dances, either at rallies or the park opening we, we just did this Saturday at Manong Delano's. We also have a Filipino themed show at the end of the year, which is called Push. Um, hello, my name is Cicely, and I am a senior at MHS, and I'm also the vice president of PUSO. My name is Leia, and I'm the historian of PUSO. Um, I think it's important and beautiful that our community members gather to celebrate Filipino culture, and I also think it's important to remember people like Larry Itliong and the Delano Manongs who helped unify us in the past and leave an impact on American history. Um, I also think that it's important for uh, Filipino culture and history to be recognized and shared with each other. Hi, my name is Jenna. Hi, my name is Gail. And I'm proud to be a Filipino American because I feel that our culture and just generally who we are, we're very hospitable and very welcoming to everyone. And Filipinos are really known for our music and our love for dance. And I think it plays an important part in our community. My name is Kaylin. My name is Mika. And okay, so to me, I think Filipino Heritage Month is really important to acknowledge and represent all the Filipino Americans in our community. So I think it's really important to highlight them and our culture. And it also gives us a chance to like come together as a community, meet new people, and have fun. Yeah. Filipino Heritage Month is important to me because it lets Let's me and a bunch of other Filipinos express who they are to the community. Thank you to the MUSD board for celebrating Filipino and Heritage Month. We appreciate that our school board is looking out for our people and making sure that we feel welcomed here. Thank you M MUSD for celebrating Filipino American Heritage Month. And Larry Itliang there.